Rosin flux is a critical part of any electronic soldering job. Flux allows for even heating from the soldering iron and quickly melts the solder for easy, strong joints. Rosin also has deoxidizing properties, ensuring solder consistency. Sometimes, however, rosin is hard to find. And if you live in Canada like me, it is nearly impossible to find other than in places like eBay or Amazon. So what can you do? You look for substitutes. One product that is superficially very similar to rosin is Vaseline. However, will it work as a flux? Let's test it. I have a connection on this part that needs to be reflowed. I'll be using the Vaseline on it. The green connectors pins will need to be reflowed in order for it to make a proper connection again. While my soldering iron heats up, I'm going to apply the, uh, the Vaseline to the correct areas. So basically right over here, these two pins, I'll just apply some Vaseline over them like this. This way, when we add the iron on top of it, it'll spread the Vaseline around and even the heat the metal contact points. So about this much should be enough. Like that. I just use an ordinary wooden toothpick or anything that you have that's sharp. And so I'll come back once my iron is heated up. Okay, the iron is now hot and we're going to proceed with the reflowing procedure. As you can see, I have my finger here pushing up that uh, green connector so that the uh, pins don't fall through as I'm melting it. So we get a nice strong bond. So I'm going to start with the pin on the left here first. So apply some heat. There we go. First bond. And now the second one. Apply some heat. Let's do that a second time. And let's test it. Let's see if that connector is moving. And it's pretty solid. So we've basically reflowed the green connector. It's not wobbling back and forth as it was before. And we have basically a solid connection. So can you use Vaseline as a soldering flux? The answer is yes. However, the only trouble that uh, exists with uh, Vaseline compared to uh, conventional rosin flux is that it does not clean. So there is no deoxidizing properties. So your surface must already have been pre-cleaned before that. Otherwise, if it's contaminated, then uh, the Vaseline does nothing for it. But, yeah, that's it. Hope this video helps.